Alright YouTube, I'm trying to overclock my processor. This is the first time I'm, I've tried to ever tackle this sort of task. And I have an AMD 6300, FX 6300. I've never done this before. I watched a YouTube tutorial and the guy was Thai and he didn't speak English but I could see his screen. I just manually copied his settings and whenever I my computer didn't crash or anything, but whenever I look at CPU Z, I see 2.9, 2. Point, well, basically 3 gigahertz instead of 4.4, which is the number I'm going for. And I'm going to uh, go through these settings and show you everything that he did, which is what I did. I copied. Let's see, manual overclocking. Uh, I put the CPU clock to 200 at first, and you can see it's at 220 because I changed it to see if that would help, and it didn't. Let's see, uh, over voltage configuration. He put the CPU V core and CPU NB over voltage both at 0 0.050 volts. Everything else is on auto. Let's see, what else did he do here? Uh, there's some advanced setting. Let's see, yeah, CPU configuration. He had di he disabled C1E, SVM, and PowerNow. Core leveling. Everything here is exactly how he did it. Except on his, the CPB mode was disabled. And I don't know how to disable it. Because it's gray and I can't click on it. Let me see here. Uh, okay, yeah. Here's the um, multiplier. 4.4 gigahertz. I set my voltage to 1.3875. And in CPU Z, it shows 1.4 or something magically. Let's see, uh, 2200 megahertz on the uh, north bridge. North bridge VID 1.1750 volts. And again, I'm just going by what this guy did. I copied his settings. I don't think he did anything in his video with any of this. He just basically went in the advanced menu and the ONE menu, overclocking menu. So I'm going to save these. I think I actually have to click here. Yeah. Save changes and reset. Let's see what happens. Oh, I got a post. Luckily I have an SSD so it's pretty fast. That is my name. Alright. CPU Z. Well, I'll just wait till my rocket dock comes up here. Okay, now it's showing uh, 3.2. Maybe I can zoom into that. Before it was showing actually 2999 megahertz. But still, I want 4.4. That's the problem I'm, I'm facing. And whenever I go to... Uh, 
Let me zoom back out. Computer. Right click. Properties. Now it's it's showing for whatever reason. Four point eight four gigahertz right here. Probably the same thing in DirectX uh, Diagnostic, which I just opened. Yes, it's showing 4.8 gigahertz, and it's obviously not running at that uh, at speed. I can open a uh, Prime 95. What is it? A hardware monitor. Run Prime 95. And let's see. Three point three gigahertz. Again, that's wrong. I don't want that. Um I don't know what else to show you. I didn't want to make this video too long. Um maybe somebody can help me, maybe not, I don't know. Let's see, I'm trying to think of core temperature. It's showing 3.2 basically 3.3 gigahertz on all six cores voltage is showing on CPU Z I failed to mention even though I was zoomed in earlier that it's uh, 1.392 volts and uh, I don't know I really don't know I'm gonna end this video it's getting too long maybe somebody can help me